All right, welcome back everyone. Welcome to another video on the Sports Card Factory YouTube channel. I'm Ryan, and the other day I came across a couple binders at a yard sale and opened a couple pages of each, and now we're gonna review the rest of those pages in those binders and have a little bit of fun. And I'll roll the video of picking those binders up right now. That's going to be it, unfortunately. Okay. You're saying well, you're, you're not taking more off my hands. <laughs> yeah. You're saying you're going to put out more. Uh, in a, probably gonna, two weeks. You're going to do another yeah, one. Yeah, it'll be just as big. Okay. Yeah. I'll be back then for of stuff. So. Thank you. Bag? All right, so here we are. Here's those two binders. Obviously, we, we know that you never want to pick up cards that are in binders because they get damaged very easily. And as you saw, I only opened the first page of this one, I believe, and then went to two pages on this one, I believe. So I, I haven't gone any further until now, and I wanted to have a little fun with it and save it. Till I got home so that's what we're doing right now I probably have maybe I, I picked up a stack of comics and all kinds of other things at that yard sale but on I'll probably have maybe a buck a piece for each of these um, or maybe even less than that so definitely very on the the cheap side I suppose of picking these up so yeah I opened this and it's gonna be kind of hard let me get this one out of the way I'm not quite sure what we're in for and again, I'm not very knowledgeable on the rookie years of all these. I do know, I believe this Randy Johnson right here. Let's see if I can get this. Is his rookie card it's poking out? I don't, I don't know if you can see that on the film a little bit, but obviously, condition of these is not going to be the greatest, I'd assume, considering they've been in these binders. Um, but yeah, we'll just go go through it. David Justice. Old Jim Palmer there, and uh, favorite player there, Will Clark. Idolized him growing up, Greg Maddox and the Cubbies. So, Nolan Ryan and Walter Johnson. So, looks like we got some 80s here, 90s, obviously. Um, curious on what this was. This was a 79, okay, that Nolan Ryan, and this Jim Palmer's an 84. All right, so next page, a couple Ruben Sierras. Kevin Johnson, a Mark McGuire, looks like I'm finding here. Griffey checklist, so a lot of just kind of $1, $2 cards looking like so far. Steve Largent, it's got to be some 70s card there. Uh, ben McDonald, Allerud, so definitely a lot of junk wax era cards so far. But... It's fun to grab these and open and see what you're going to get. And if there's anything valued, you know, obviously, as you've probably seen by now, post a little screenshot of what I'll be putting these up on the eBay store if they're of consideration or worthy. I saw Bo Jackson right here. I didn't even catch that. I first was looking at all these. We've got David Robinson down here three of them so I'm guessing these are the rookie cards if it's showing rookie I don't know how they had it set I'm not quite sure if that's the actual rookie card or or what but and the next page a whole bunch of 90s Donruss got a Otis Anderson and a Dwight Clark Wow, that's going to go in the collection for sure, even though the conditions 
not too great on that bad boy, but Niners fan and Giants fan for sure. So that's nice to have. I don't know if that's his rookie. That's way back. Let's see. Um, nothing else I'm really seeing here. Let's see what year that was. Whoops, we, I think, jumped the page. Yeah, I just want to see that. Wait, Clark, 81. Okay. So, some more 90s Donruss. Lucky me. But, definitely cool to kind of see what you can pick up. I sell singles, so I don't have a problem getting rid of all these for low cheap. Real cheap singles. Trying to get that feedback rating number skyrocketed with a whole bunch of one dollar twosies cards so but also have some others on there 90 score robin yunt hall of famer mark grace ripkin let's see sandy elmar senior i should say that robin yunt uh, look damage on the back it's rough corner there but 84 Next page, got some kind of modern coming up here, but 90 Sammy Sosa, Larry Walker, Mark Grace, Plaxico Burris, Ray, oh man, not going to like me for this. Let me try, Borke, I'm going to say Borke. Not quite sure if I'm correct on that, but I have zero knowledge of historical hockey when it comes down to it. But we got this Los Angeles Lakers team leaders. Not recognizing anyone on there. It's of noteworthy. So let's see, what was this Ray Burke? It was a 81. Okay. No, oh, there's a couple on the back here. Another Ray Burke, so man, these cards are rough. But we're definitely getting more 70s, 80s. But yeah, they're they're not doing too well. I'm not recognizing anyone that I'm seeing. It's fun. These are really fun to look at though. These are let's see. 69. Okay, I just jumped multiple decades and we're going in the 60s so interesting it's cool to have i've never had any cards that that old that's first for sure so actually i think i might have a 60s or 50s of uh, Gaylord perry but man look at these cards look at that face it's like caught him out going to practice and said hey stand by this wall <laughs> thrilled so, wow, this this card's rough, but yeah, I'm gonna look if any of these have value, but got some stickers here, but yeah, that was kind of, I mean, hey, for a buck, not too bad, right? It's fun to look at, see what you're gonna get. All right, this is, I know there's a Michael Jordan on this first page, so let's see what we're coming up with. We have obviously the rated rookie, Randy Johnson, Got a Wade Boggs, Pete Rose, a little rough corner there. What is that, the 86, I think, of Jose Canseco. And I don't know too much about, this is some all-star, obviously. Let's see, what, 1990, so nothing of interest there for Michael Jordan. Probably just a dollar card, but I may be off on that. You know, assuming any Jordan card has obviously value, but um, let's see anything else there. George Brett, not a bad one. It's poking out on the end, but that's, uh, let's see, 83 George Brett. So it's Pete Rose. It's 83 as well. Second page, so I've not seen any of this. Uh, or actually, I think I went to the third page on this because there's a Griffey behind on the next page and then I stopped there I got Yaz's grandfather there so let's 
see. It's like a funny looking car. I thought it was a Mini at first, but there's a gray border around it. I'm not quite sure what year flare those are. Tony Fernandez. Let's see, Mark Langston, Joe Carter with the Indians. I didn't even know he played with the Indians, but it makes sense. There's another one, obviously, of Joe Carter up there at the top. So, I'm going to go through, obviously, Mike Schmidt, see if any of these are rookie cards. I, I just don't have that vast knowledge yet. Getting there, though. And yeah, this is a, a beat-up rated rookie of Griffey, so... Roger Staubach, kind of historical Dallas Cowboys quarterback. Kellen Winslow Sr. Bobby Bonilla, Gary Sheffield, future stars. Brett Saberhagen. So yeah, this is, now we're venturing into deep waters. I've not been here yet. Looks like we got another rated rookie of Griffey. Looks to be in a little bit of better shape, but some 86 rows and Lenny Dykstra up there. Reggie Jackson. Some Pro Bowl stuff of Barry Sanders. I don't know if this is considered the Pro Set rookie card of Emmett Smith, but uh, I've got another Barry Sanders ground force down there. Looks in decent condition. Cecil Fielder when he wasn't Munching on cheeseburgers all the time. David Wells. Let's see. Red rookie of Benito Santiago. McGuire. 87. I'm not quite sure. Nice little Pete Rose here. Not quite sure on how this McGuire is. Is this... Might be considered his rook. I can't remember what it looks like, but definitely Tacoma. It says 86 he was on the A's, but I'm not quite sure if they had a card for that year. So that might be his rookie. Bill Jackson, future stars. Nice little Will Clark. I think that's considered a version of his rookie or, or close to. I think that's the year after. Mark McGuire. Rookie Gold Cup. Oops, hit the camera here. Yeah, that Will Clark. Not quite sure, but I should know. I do have, I believe it's his, oh man, was it 86? This is his rookie for, so this is 87. I think that was his second year. So, yeah, 86 is. Paul Clark's rookie. And yeah, some more Mark McGuire's. Jeff George. And a Browns jersey, I'm assuming that's the Browns. It's gotta be. I didn't know they had blue stripes. With the Colts. Indianapolis Colts. Were maybe were they bought no, they weren't Baltimore back that far back in ninety. They're still in. Okay, so Next page, Troy Aikman, Jerry Rice. Try to speed this up maybe a little bit here. Not seeing anything crazy outstanding. Did I gotta, no, okay. Um, Warren Moon, Montagna, Scotty Pippen, John Riggins, running back. Bonds, Mark Grace rated rookie, another Scotty Pippen. So, coming down to the wire here, another Barry Sanders. Sorry if I'm getting off screen. I'm trying to look at these over the camera and not through the camera. Jim Abbott in a Pittsburgh. Oh, no. Jeez. Michigan Wolverines. That's an interesting card. That's a cool one. He had a nice little decent career with the Angels. Tony Esposito, Blackhawks, Chicago Blackhawks goalie. I'm not too sure. Let's see this. Oh, don't recognize any of those. Oh, that's NHL. Okay. So, Tom Gordon, yeah. All right. Randall Cunningham, Gary Sheffield. And 
Is this the last page? Yeah, it looks to be the last page. So, can, yeah, I'm not seeing Eric Dickerson down there. It's a nice little one. Not quite sure if it mean Joe Green right there. So, looks like there's some doubles each of these. So, I'll be all right. Oh, there was a, what was that, a jo Jordan? I, I totally missed. Yeah, the same one. Just trying to look at some of these years, but I'll hold the the time clock there. So if you enjoyed that, thanks for watching. Went through it together. Definitely not a bad little pickup of some historical cards and some some junk, <laughs> but it was good to pick up for hey what maybe max of two dollars both these. I think it was worth it for sure. So if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. Thanks for watching. Catch y'all in the next video. Have a good one.